Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of How to Hack. First things first, a massive shout out to uh, Brandon, what was his name? The Brandon14200 and um, Arthur Salazar for completing the CTF2 challenge first. Those two guys were the first two to uh, finish that one. So congratulations guys. And um, yeah, I hope we'll see maybe you guys are the first ones to complete this one as well. Um, I'll, I'll have to send you guys a prize at some point, um, so keep an eye on your DMs because uh, I'm going to be sliding in there and sending you some sweet, sweet stuff. Moving on, in, uh, in this lesson we're going to learn about uh, steganography. Um, we're also going to revisit uh, security through obscurity. Um, we're going to go through some ROT13 uh, decoding again and a little bit of binary. Uh, translation or decoding, whatever you want to call it. Um, and there is also an epic riddle at the end of this challenge. So I guess at the moment you're thinking, what the hell is steganography? And bear with me, I'll explain it to you. Steganography is the practice of concealing a file, message, image or video with another file, message, image or video. The word steganography combines the Greek words steganos meaning covered, concealed or protected and the graphene meaning writing. Uh, hackers are able to use steganography to um, inject all sorts of scripts in the back end um, but it's not always used for bad things. Um, in this case I'm just encoding some secret messages in uh, certain images and yeah, it's your job to figure it out and get through the challenge. Um, so basically, steganography is just like um, parents hiding carrots in their kids' uh, spaghetti sauce. So, the tools you are going to need to complete this challenge are uh, a computer with internet access. Unfortunately, this one doesn't work on phones, so you will have to use a computer. Any computer will do. Um, you're going to need a binary translator a um, steganography uh, decoder or decipher um, and the rot13.com uh, decoding website. Um, I'll put a link in the description for each one of those so you can get through it nice and easy. So to begin the CTF you're going to have to browse to www.cybersecguidance.com forward slash Steganography. There is also a link in the description for that to get started with. Uh, so good luck to you all and as always have uh, fun and if you have trouble leave a comment um, below or reach out to me on Twitter or Instagram or whatever and um, I'll see if I can help you out and get you through the challenge. Also don't forget to subscribe for uh, more of these CTFs. I've got a few more plans, some really fun ones. Um, we're going to get harder and harder as it goes, obviously. Um, there's a few that I want to get done, like um, deciphering uh, Wireshark um, logs and uh, all, yeah, all sorts of really cool stuff. So stick around uh, further down the track and I'll get those out to you. Wow. You stuck around to the end of the video. Congratulations. You get a little hint for this challenge, which is the answer to the riddle can be found in Google. 